All right, here we go. A big <laughs> night in Class A basketball. Yeah, we got semifinal action on the boys and girls side. All right, but let's start with the girls first. And we have Century and Legacy in the first semifinal. In the first half, Century's Chloe Markfish slices to the defense and finishes with a sweet layup as Century goes up 28 to 16. Then soon after, it's Markovic again, this time from downtown. She led the team with 15 points. Century starting to pull away now as Haley Fletcher gets the ball on the wing and pulls up with a mid-range jumper. Century led 37-16 at the half. Century is back in the championship with a 60-25 win. All right, in the other semifinal game, Devils Lake taking on West Fargo Cheyenne. In the first half, Cheyenne's Maggie Manson drives into the paint and pulls up for the J. Cheyenne still down 31-18. The Firebirds were red hot. Matea Vetch, a big part of it, hits from downtown to put her team up 34-19. But she wasn't done. She hits another three here. She went five of five from deep in the first half. And soon after, Jess Mertens in transition, spins around one, and Euro steps another defender for a big bucket. 57-29 at the half, and the Firebirds win 80-57. They'll take on the Pats tomorrow. All right, let's go to the consolation bracket. Williston against Mandan. In the first half, Mandan's Kennedy Harris finds Sydney Gustafson. And she's in the corner and she hits the three as Mandan goes up 11 to 8. But Williston would hang around. Corbin Davis kicks to Makaya Remus and she connects on the triple to tie the game at 11. Then soon after, Lauren Gaggle finds Gustafson and she hits another three. Mandan led by one at the half and Mandan would eventually pull away. They win 72 to 49. They'll play early tomorrow morning. In the other consolation game, Red River taking on Shanley. In the first half, some quick passing frees up Red River's Alexis Belgardi and the three is good to make the score 13-6 Red River. A little bit later, Alex Page collapses the zone and gets the easy two underneath. It's 18-8 Red River. And that solid half continued as Shelby Frank with the pick and slip to the basket. Red River holds on for the upset. 63-52 your final in that one. So in the championship tomorrow, top seed from the East Devils Lake against the top seed from the West 